Hey guys, welcome back to another plan with me. This week I'm planning for the week of January the 31st to February the 6th. So I'm using, I kind of got a little bit out of order. And so I'm going to go ahead and go back and use a kit that I skipped over. And it was this one from Tilly Plans because it's so pretty. It's Winter Solace, uh, Solace, I think that's how you say it. But I just loved the the little, you know, woodland creatures. And actually, I saw an owl in my yard. I think that was yesterday. I'm filming this on Sunday. Yeah, it was Saturday. I saw an owl in my yard. And um, I actually got to see him glide from one tree to another. And so anyway, I just seeing that made me think I have to use this kit this week. So that is what I'm doing. And so I have this as part of the kit. And then we also have the um oh i got i got the tipsy dog numbers out but it looks like she already has numbers on here but i got the full uh what do you call it tpc nation kit and so there you know i like this washi a lot i'm gonna I'll probably use that for when i'm reading like the same book throughout the week because i typically am not like a super fast reader these days just because who has the time but Anyway, that's what I'll be using. So sit back and relax. Pour yourself a drink. Uh, we're going to get to these boogers eventually. And um, right now I am drinking white wine. But pour whatever you like and play with me. So I think I will start with the days of the week. And I know I don't like to cover Stephanie Grant Vance's lettering very much. But sometimes I do just because I also don't. When I have too many leftovers, if I can help it, because I'm trying to use up everything that I have and really take full stock of what I have so that um, I'm not overbuying because that is definitely a problem of mine. And so it's also a huge reason that I'm going to do a, um, I'm not buying any kits for my EC Daily Duo because I have the A5 rings and so I'm using washi for that. I'm making my own date headers like if I cover up the date that's printed in the EC Daily Duo. So if I cover that up then I'll you know I'll cover I'll use some dates that I printed off or days of the week that I printed off. So that actually works out great and um and I can save some money. So my I work for a nonprofit full time. And so, um, I actually took a pay cut from my last job because I'm an accountant. So I worked in corporate America for, let's see, 2012 through 2019. So about seven years I worked in corporate America and then, um, uh, moved to nonprofit life in 2019 and right before all the madness. So I actually started my job in, um, Let's see, in September of 2019, where I am now. And I absolutely love it. I, like I said, I took a pay cut, but, but that's because I'm working for a nonprofit, obviously. So they can't afford to pay people the kind of salaries that, you know, corporate America can afford. And that's fine by me because I feel like I'm doing like a you know, sort of like social service to, um, to the community. And I love, I don't know. I love the people. I love what I do. I love, the, I mean, the, the way they treat their employees is just fantastic. And so I'm just, I'm very, very happy with it. So anyway, um, hopefully one day I can get this channel monetized. That would be lovely. And so I can afford my sticker habit because I, have been having too much fun with this hobby and it can get quite expensive if we're not lying um but it's to me it's so worth it it's so uh, therapeutic i have lots of issues with anxiety and um a lot of history with depression because of a lot of tragic events in my past and so planning is such a great outlet and just a great way to like be creative in a different way sort of at least to me it's creative so, and I love supporting local artists. Like, this is so pretty. I don't know how you don't love that. So, and I love playing with stickers. I know I'm an adult, I'm an adult that plays with stickers and that's okay. That's all right with me. So let's see. I'm definitely using the wise owl for my reading. That's that middle category here. 
I'll use the deer for food. I know that's horrible, but I grew up eating deer meat. That's our dinner category. My dad was a hunter. My granddaddy was a hunter. He raised my brothers to be hunters. I hunted with my dad. I've never killed anything because um, the idea of shooting the gun scared me. I was afraid it was going to like kick back and shoot in like bump me in the head because that happened to my cousin actually. And he had a big old like welt on his head. So I, <laughs> I was not about that life. But I like to go and my dad would bring me gummy bears and we'd sit in the deer stand. And, you know, he would just tell me to be quiet. So I'd take a nap in the deer stand and eat gummy bears and just, you know, look through the binoculars at deer. So that was fun. Good childhood memories. But, um, Anyway, let's see. Let's do this for wellness because I need to soar. I know I'm so cheesy, y'all. Uh, so cheesy, it hurts. Do you guys know your Enneagram? If you do, drop it down below. I'm an Enneagram 9, so if you know me at all, that's probably not surprising. Let's see. Let's do... Let's do this for the family because, you know making babies i'm just kidding we only have two and we're done we're happy with the two they are more than i can handle <laughs> so i have my boy and i have a girl so i am super satisfied and done with the making babies front in case you're wondering okay let's see i think that's all i'm going to do for right the second on that and then i guess we need to go ahead oh, let's lay down the categories first because that's more fun than sticking down all the headers i'm gonna do that in a minute and i know i'm a procrastinator but oh well let's do family first as always and then we have wellness which is me getting in my squats and stuff and then we'll do reading also a good habit of mine i'm trying to Hone in on this year. We have dinner just because I like to track what we're eating. Then it's no surprise my, my weight goes up in the wellness when we have pizza night. So, because spoiler alert, we did that this past week and I'm fine with it. I'm just saying now I'll have a clue as to why if I don't see something positive on the scale or, you know, in a positive frame of mind. I don't know. In the positive direction. Or, no, we want it to not be in the positive direction. We want it to be in the negative direction. But you know what I'm talking about. Anyway. Okay, let's do... I'm going to do these steps. Because I think this gold kind of goes pretty with the blue. I'm liking that right now. And these are from Taryn's Sticker Shop. You know, typically there's like more silver than there really is gold in this kind of color scheme but there's some browns in these headers and so i figured the gold and the greens and the browns would look nice together so that's what i'm going to go with but you do whatever you feel sorry if you're screaming at me through the camera but it doesn't match this is what i am going to go with for now All right, there is that. Only six of these, which kind of stinks. I was hoping to do that for dinner. Let's do... I only have six of those. Or I hate that I don't have seven of everything. Let's see. Or, you know, an odd number, actually, in this case, would work well. Okay, let's see. I'm going to grab... I think this blue would look pretty for up here. We'll scalp action and we will go ahead and put February. I know we got the 31st, but mostly we've got February. So we will put that there and let me start on all of these lovely, lovely headers. I look at Rivers 
still hear the calling of Tennessee. And who are we to know where these rivers flow? Okay, so my camera cut me off, but I went ahead and laid down all the headers, so that looks super pretty, and I'm very happy with how that looks. And then I've got, this is all done, so all I need to put in now are my squat challenge things. Okay, let's see. I think for dinner, I will still go ahead and use these and do like a little fork and knife icon on each of these. And the fire flies in midnight and the color of the leaves in the fall. All right, so I know that's random, but that's okay. It'll work. And then I'll probably save most of these for any appointments. I actually don't really think I have anything going on this coming week that I know of. So that's nice. A nice calm week. I will probably fill in. I mean, this is my base spread. So I'll probably fill in the rest of it as I go. But I really love how this looks. I need to take that down a little bit. That's a sticky peeled off on accident. But I love how this looks and so I think I will just leave it at the base spread and fill in as I go. So as you can see like last week I just kind of fill in things as they happen. So that is it. Thank you so much for watching and please like, share, subscribe, all those things and follow me on my Instagram at Allie Plans. Do all of the things and I will see you in the next video. Thanks again for watching. Bye. Have a great week.